Hello, this is Kate, and this is my second sub game of the summer season. This week I'm subbing in for the Grey Team. This is my first game of the night, and then my own team played immediately after. It's always nice to uh, get a chance to wear a jersey that matches my pads. Normally I would wear a jersey that matched the team I was subbing for, but I, I didn't actually have a gray jersey at the time. I keep losing my depth and sort of swinging back and forth like a pendulum, and I really need to work on planting my feet and staying out of the top of the crease. And then on the goal, one of two things, I either needed to commit with the poke check and let out more of my stick towards that puck, or just get my, my foot and my pad flush with the post as fast as possible. I got so lucky with this rebound. I just have my glove in the perfect position to eat up the next shot. Always feels nice. At least I was quick about getting back to the top of the crease on that pass. Nice, I could get a hold of that rebound and not let them uh, get it around me into, into the open net. And that's the end of the first period. After all the scrambling, I was really uh, glad to get that first save. It's just super unfortunate that the uh, rebound, that they were able to uh, bounce the puck off my face into the net. That said, it's just another instance of me needing to learn to follow the puck and, uh, you know, immediately butterfly slide to the posts uh, following a rebound. I'm just not able to do that quite yet. During one of the whistles, I decided to see if I could figure out how to do T-pushes. Hey, look at that. I actually learned from my mistakes, followed the puck, pushed my way to the post to uh, cover up the follow-up, and it actually worked. I was trying to get myself to continue doing that even if there wasn't an imminent threat of a shot just to sort of get that mu muscle memory going. Man, where was that butterfly flare in the last game? I could have used that then. And that's the end of the second period. It's funny to see reflexes I learned in the past playing against guys that like to chip away at my glove after I covered a rebound. It looks so out of place in this league where people are really, really rare to do something like that. I'm not even sure if I saw that shot, so it's a good thing I had my leg in the right place. 
And what was that ugly dive? Oh my gosh. That's embarrassing. Well, I certainly got lucky there. That was, I really needed to cover that post a lot better. Good thing that I have a big stick. A lot of shots going against the grain in this game. I'm surprised how many of them I managed to get. And that is the end of the game. It ended in a 2-0 loss, which is always unfortunate when you're subbing. It's always nice to go in there and get them a win, but it doesn't always work out. Uh, I thought overall I played pretty well. Made a couple mistakes, but I also learned from them. Um, that's always nice to see. Anyways, I had to play another game right after this one, so that one will be up uh, fairly soon. But for now, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.